Hey guys, today um, I'm going to be doing my first cooking video. And you're probably wondering, well, cooking video, like, is this following something up? Yes, it is. Um, if you guys saw, I actually had a video of me doing pest control on European sparrows or house sparrows. And I shot a couple of them. And if you guys saw that video, hopefully you liked it and gave it a thumbs up. But yeah, I went and shot some of those sparrows out at the farm. They're a big nuisance. So uh, we got rid of them. And I actually, um, aside from feeding a couple of them to the farm cats, I also breasted some of them out and have a little bit of meat. So I'm going to show you how to cook sparrow right now. Hope you guys enjoy. And maybe in another video, I'll show you guys how to um, take the meat off of a sparrow. Step number one, wash them off under the sink. Get all the grass and uh, feathers and whatnot off. And like I said, these are skinned. And this is only the breast meat. Um, as you can tell, the lighter ones is the female and the darker ones is the male. Um, they have no difference in taste to me. So... Once you um, have the breast meat and it's all washed, you're going to put it on the pan and I'll show you what to do next. Here's all the ingredients that you need for the way that I make it. Pepper, salt, some garlic, and some olive oil. Now you'll take the oil. Put a little bit of oil in the pan. Yep. And you want to cut up your garlic. Okay, Next, you have your garlic. You just throw it in the pan. And the final step is to put your pepper and your salt. So just a little bit of each. Now you're going to just want to finish cooking it. So here's everything. I'll let you know when it starts cooking. Then you just want to flip them once they start to look like they're getting ready. And it does not take long. Now they are done. And it's as simple as that. All you need is salt, pepper, garlic, and some oil. You just want to cook them until they're brown on one side. Flip it over, brown on the other side. And make sure it's not too firm. After that, you got a delicious and tasty little snack and also a good use for those pest house sparrows that are around. So this is how you do make how you make a delicious little snack. That's all and hope you enjoyed. Mmm.